a new view of an often violent ocean predator, the shark. Until now, it was nearly impossible to get a clear picture of their nocturnal hunting patterns. Tonight, we're taking you deep into shark infested waters to see these mysterious and mythical creatures like never before. Jesse Palmer is taking the plunge. Now's kind of the moment where nerves, they're kind of picking up. It's dusk off the coast of the Bahamas, and we're headed out further into the deep, preparing for a dive into shark infested waters in complete darkness. It's getting harder to see down there. Uh, that's going to go over your arm. Okay, cool. I'll be honest, I'm having second thoughts. Well, you're going to see a lot of sharks. The lights don't really shoot out that far. So we're really only going to see them when they're kind of right on top of us. But for a chance to see one of the ocean's deadliest predators, as few have ever seen them before, it's worth the risk. Hey, here comes some seals on our run. Oh, my god. Scientists have tried for years to research and record the nocturnal hunting patterns of these sharks. Unbelievable. Their findings previously limited to grainy night vision footage. Now, revolutionary advances in low light cameras are allowing them to clearly see the sharks, even under the cover of darkness, for the first time. When you look through the viewfinder of this camera, it looks like it's the middle of the day. Making it possible to closely study their nighttime hunting habits and capture jaw dropping shots like this. Whoa! That was unbelievable! A great white off the coast of South Africa, breaching in the moonlight for a Discovery Shark Week special, Air Jaws Night Stalker. I really think these new cameras are going to allow us to see into the nighttime world of the great white shark like never before. But before I can dive into the dark to see this secret world of sharks for myself, I have to get my feet wet during the daytime to prepare. We're here in the Bahamas. We're going to get up close and personal with some sharks, and I'm ready to go. Going to go under here? I get a crash course in diving. What's up, man? How are you? And meet up with my guide, Andy Casagrande, a renowned underwater cinematographer who studies shark behavior. I've been diving with sharks for about 15 years now, all over the world. Filming them at night can be a challenge because you really can't see them until they come into the you know, range of your lights. And then once they disappear from the lights, it's basically anyone's guess where they went. And the last thing you want is a shark to sneak up on you in the dark. So it gets a little sketchy, I won't lie. You know, the number one rule I try to live by is to not act like prey, because if you act like prey, the sharks will treat you like prey. Okay, how do you act like prey? Swim Cause, away. Because I don't want to do you know, that. Frantically, you know, panic and swim away. Sharks get a bad rap, but for the most part, they're really polite predators. They're really chill. Polite predators. Yeah, I mean, they could kill us, but it's pretty, <laughs> Politely, though. pretty unlikely. <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, yeah, it is. The worst case scenario is we could die, but the best case scenario is you have an amazing time and learn something about sharks. I'm hoping for the best case scenario. And as we approach the diving site, the reef sharks here are in full force. All right, you ready to do this, buddy? We jump in with nothing but our scuba gear and wetsuits, no cages. It's pretty amazing down here, hey? Oh, my God, are you see that? Crazy. They're literally everywhere. This guy's like that. I way into my personal space. I gotta be honest, I thought I was gonna be completely freaking out down here amidst all these sharks. There's something very zen, very calm. Of course, during a night dive, it might be a little bit different. When it comes to hunting in dark seas, sharks have a biological advantage. Their heightened senses include powerful night vision, reflective cells behind the retina that allow sharks to see 10 times better than humans in the dark. Also crucial, their sensitivity to vibrations in the water, allowing them to feel what they can't see. For sharks to be able to hunt in essentially total darkness, their prey has to be hyper vigilant, hyper agile. So whatever they're hunting almost have no chance. These abilities make tracing their nighttime hunting patterns particularly important for researchers. Now let's try this area here. Using sonar to track their movement on the ocean floor as the sharks stalk after seals. Whoa, look at that. But this adeptness is also what makes diving with them in pitch black waters so daunting. You going, Trinity? When the scientists in South Africa follow the great whites into the deep, they have a cage to protect them. They're coming in hot. <laughs> Chris, you OK? Look at the shark trying to get in the cage with you. But once again, we're going in with that one. They are more prone to being a bit more feisty and competitive at nighttime. I mean, you're a big dude. You're fine. You could just punch yeah. one of those I mean, they're, they're, they're only 12 feet long. It's fine. You'll see how agile they are and how good their, you know, their vision is and their senses because they can clue in on anything, even in total darkness. So 
I think it's uh, I think it's gonna be pretty epic, man. It's go time. It was a great idea three weeks ago. <laughs> it was a great idea three hours ago. Now that it's pitch black, I'm wondering the exact same thing. What am I doing right now? Okay, ready. One, two, three. It's crazy. It, it's like you're in the abyss. You can't see anything. You really can't even hear anything. Oh boy, this one's a big one. That's a really, really big thing. Oh jeez. Oh my god. <laughs> I have all my fingers, the second best news. And it is just so eerie down there. And you have some of the world's greatest predators literally circling you without any concept of where they are. That's sort of their realm, that's their world. Sharks love to use that element of ambush. And we survived. That was, that was awesome, man. Yeah. That's something I'm never gonna forget. An epic experience with some of nature's most powerful hunters lurking in the depths just out of sight. For Nightline, I'm Jesse Palmer in the Bahamas. And you can see Shark Week all week on Discovery.